There once was a Gerard Peek Kung flashback, go to center back. He can also attack, play at striker instruction set, and he bangs goals like Messi. Oh, when the PK man comes, he's gonna steal my girl Shakira, what have you done? Oh, when the PK man comes, Pickel Miss screaming without the S. This is 100% positively the Striker PK episode yet, but I need to figure out how to say this guy's last name, and I asked you guys on Twitter. Uh, Danny Aaron said, Baron... Baronich... Okay, that doesn't help. Literally helps zero. Baronichea? They pronounce it here. Baronichea. Baronichea. Emmanuel Alguacil, are you proud of me? What's up, boys, and welcome to the 96 flashback Gerard PK, aka P Cunt, a card that we have arguably the most history with throughout the course of Ultimate Team. Now, if you want me to tell the story about Shakira, me, and PK going all the way back to 2013 when I was an exchange student in Barcelona, that's where the whole meme came from. Actually, started as something in real life and then ended up uh, becoming a little bit of a little bit, a little, a little bit of a meme. It started out. Um, I actually lived in the same apartment complex as uh, as Shakira back before they even like started dating. It was just it was just whole this this weird thing. We were downstairs like as part of the apartment complex. There was like a tapas place down below, and one there was one evening. It was me, uh, her, and then a bunch of the other kids from the uh, from the from the exchange program. And I had like a little I had a drink, and uh, I don't know if you guys know, but tapas is basically like these little finger foods in Spain that you would have like uh, historically like you go out at a night on a town or just like these little finger you know little little bite sized uh, snacks, and you would put it on top of your drink, and that's why it's called tapas because on top on tapas. So like. Um, I would, uh, you know, I, I had my tapas on top. I had tapas. I, I had a little tapas thing on top of the thing. And then uh, there was this like weird thing that happened. And then PK came by and then knocked it over. And then that was it. And then I never, I never saw her again. But anyway, that's neither here nor there. We've got this 96 yard PK. You guys are trying to figure out if you want to spend the 300, 315,000 coins to unlock this card. It is a 96 rated card. Two star skill moves, three star weak foot, six, four high medium. All that stuff that you get, uh, all that stuff that you remember uh, from his card. What did he get it for? He got it for he uh, earning a flash celebrating his inclusion in the foot 17 team of the season if you guys do enjoy the epis if you guys remember the flashback if you guys remember the striker pk epis all the way back in the day smash like in the video smash like in the video i don't know i don't know smash like in the video if you guys like dunkin donuts and the munchkin balls filled with cream cheese if you guys are dunkin aficionados you guys know exactly what i'm talking about if you guys are new to the channel hit that subscribe button down below so let's take a look at the stats First thing you see when you look at the card is 80 pace, and you're thinking to yourself, okay, what's the combination there? It is exactly 76 acceleration, 83, 83 sprint speed. That goes up to 86 acceleration and 93 sprint speed, which I think is good enough, uh, even now in these late stages of FIFA 21. Uh, we're going to bounce over to the defending because he's got 99 defensive awareness and 96 reactions. Those are the two most important stats alongside sprint speed, which at 93, that's fine. Those 96 reactions and 99 defensive awareness are both good enough, uh, are arguably the most important stats that you could have on a uh, on a center back i'm fully expecting him to be one of those guys that just envelops any attacker that comes towards us 85 stamina is fine 98 strength with 90 aggression and no defensive stat that is below 95 this is well and truly a ridiculous card Pikelme, if you're watching congratulations uh ea have given you exactly what you were hoping for uh we've got the hunter chem style on him because like i said defending is already jacked off enough there's no reason to get those any higher and uh we actually have him on play as striker in the instruction set so he's going to go up to 80 finishing and then his shot power is going to go up to 82 with uh 74 attacking positioning doesn't have any real traits to speak of other than leadership and mr steal your girl uh and then of course if we're running running a la liga side we've got uh Barana over there is left wing. We got the Jordi Alba, who we pack pulled uh, yesterday, and then we've got Cochino. We've got ourselves Busquets, and then of course PK had to run those boys together. And then we are going, of course, with uh, we're going, of course, with Kareem the Dream Benzema. Want to continue giving him a shot and see if uh, she, if he, see if she, she, see if he can rise to the occasion. Match number one with PK. Vamos. <laughs> First off, we want to see how he feels on the ball. He's got 81. He's got 81 agility, so man can. All right. So if we have him as play a striker, what does that mean exactly? If we have him as play a striker, All right? I have him on the play a, play a striker instruction set. Did you guys know that PK actually is a really good futsal player? Like technically, he's really really good on the ball. It's not an in by PK. Okay, so he, he wins the ball back easily. L l lumbering a little bit is one word I would use to describe him. A little, little bit of a lumberer. See, that's what that's what I'm that's what I'm expecting from uh, that's what I'm expecting from him. All right, 
there we go, PK, dude, that's, that's, you wanna know what that is? That's the 99 reactions, that's the, uh, that's the 99 defensive awareness right there. Right, there's PK right there. I mean, like, that is, that's, that is PK, get it? P PK? PK again, really, really nice defensive, uh, really, really nice defensive positioning. Here's Baran the chair. Right, the one, one thing that he's got going from his pace doesn't have the best composure, but does that matter? Right, he's got nice agility and a nice little finesse. But this is FIFA 21, so of course there's going to be an auto block. There's PK. Yeah, there's PK again. He's crazy. Coutinho. There we go. That's got to be in. Philly Coutinho. Come on, boys. 1-1. One, one. We deserve that. Um, yeah, I, I go so far as to say... I go so I, I go so far as to say that he's pretty decent value, to be honest with you. Now, the question is, have EA been listening? Is he there for only seven days? He's there for two days? EA, wh why is he... Why is he there for only two days? I don't understand. This is a Flash SPC. It's literally a flashback Flash PK SPC. Kareem the Dream Benzema, the body faint, the the body faint masterclass boys, dude. La Liga, La Liga team of the dude. La Liga team of the season is legitimately insane. Right, that's against him. Literally suctions the ball out of uh, out of Mbappe. Do you want to invite your friends for tapas? This is an interesting little stat. According to the Foot Librarian, uh, Flashback PK is the highest rated flashback in Foot history and tied for the highest rated card he has ever received. Coutinho. Ah, it's impossible! Alright, so here's a good idea of the pace, right? That's Lucas Vasquez, team of the season card. Yeah, nice little interception from Pique. Paranache. La maneja cross. Le pega Benzema y se abrazan. For for a big man, Kareem Benzema moves super super silky. Right? Doesn't have the lean body type, uh, but the 97 dribbling, you absolutely feel it. He is a he is a he's a well-oiled Mercedes. Otra buena pelota este chico está iluminado. Ah, son un ballet. Para Nache with a nice first touch. Love that. PK. Look how much look how much respect he gives me. Done. That's game over, boys. That's gonna be 2-0. Here's a good test for PK. Skillful players in the game, Philly Cochino, and it, and it's like nothing, Grim. You literally just tap circle, and he just blasts through. Look at him. <laughs> and then he just gets back to position. You don't have to. Work. Dude, I have him on play as striker, and he just sits back. It, he just he just tucks into his position, and uh, and ju and just does his job. Nope. Yeah, I don't think so. Might not be scoring bicycle kick goals, but he's doing bicycle kick clearances, and it's things you absolutely love to see. Gerard Pique. Y le queda la pelota de nuevo. Se puede venir el gol. Pique. Let's go, boys. Freaking Pique, boys. Do you see the hustle on the lad? Yo, PK doesn't give up. Like, he's literally... He just envelops players. They have no chance. He, like, the, the PK just stops them in the track. Like, he's, he, he's, he's an absolute wall.
He fights for the badge. I can say a lot of things about PK. But in terms of his usability as a flashback card, 96, I know maybe they even... You know what? Some people will not be satisfied with the 83 sprint speed. And I can tell you right now... You have nothing to worry about. <laughs> you have nothing to worry about. Because he could do stuff like that with PK. The absolute scenes. PK, man, that one was for you, my guy. Sven Bender's got the exact same thing. Sven Bender has the same thing where you just like literally tap circle. You don't want to press it too hard because that's a hard challenge. Um, and then Benzo just... That's just Benzema things. That's just Team of the Season Benzema things. Again, PK. <laughs> the shot power. The shot power is so tough. Ahí la tiene Piqué. Ahí está, le va a pegar. Era muy buena la here we go. See the ball control there? That's literally left analog stick dribbling with... Oh wait, PK is. With 92 dribbling, does PK have, tech, does, does PK have techno dribbling? Okay, PK may not have techno dribbling, but he has a little. He, he's got a. He's got a bit of a finesse shot. You can score goals with Gerard PK. For those of you guys that want a little bit of a challenge for weekend league or you want a challenge towards the end of the game. Uh, for some of you guys that are maybe checking out a little bit early, uh, Gerard, yeah, there we go, rage quit. Gerard, <laughs> Gerard Piquet coming in with the Hattie. Six out of six tackles one. Wow. All right, boys, so we have three games with Piquet played. He scored a Hattie in the last one, just having a little bit of fun with the highest rated in FIFA history uh, f uh, flashback Piquet card. Now, in terms of value, while he's a really, really good card, and he's a guy that you could throw fodder into for only the next two days, and that's going to come into my valuation, I, 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 I'm going to, I'm going to take off marks. I have to take off marks for it because he only is there for two days. Literally, he's only there for 48 hours. I wanted to almost give this a four and a half out of five in terms of value, but I got to give it a four. That's obviously still pa a passing grade. I think you know, if you do this card, he'll be in your La Liga squad till the end of uh, till the end of the game cycle. I think four out of five. I almost want to give it a three and a half out of five because he's there for 48 hours, but he does have, like I said, 96 reactions and 99 defense awareness but in terms of a center back he is absolutely dominant i'm going to give him a four and a half out of five can't remember the last time i gave a card a four and a half out of five uh in terms of on the pitch performance there are some good options in la liga if you don't want to go out and spend the 320,000 coins uh on this spc but if you do have some fodder if you're a barca supporter and you just love pk uh this is uh i guarantee you i promise you you won't regret getting him in your squad um and uh, just a very, very, very good top-end level card. Could be a little bit faster, but didn't notice any deficiencies in game. Because he does have 93 sprint speed, and he gets there uh, with 86 acceleration. But that's going to do it for the episode, you boys. If you guys did enjoy, smash like. If you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button down below. Catch you guys later on stream for the Icon Swaps grind and some share plays and just some gameplay stuff. Uh, very much looking forward to firing up that stream tonight. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. Catch you guys for another upload tomorrow. Till next time, bros. Tschüss. Later. Ade.